Lift his log one week from our trip towards the sun. I managed to escape this habitation, however momentarily, but even while I was away, I was sucked in by the pull of planet power lifting. On day one, I worked up to a 275 kilo triple on squat. Raw squat, that's the best I've done in a long time. It's certainly um, the first time I've been over 600 pounds on my raw squat for a long time, especially for reps. Uh, it didn't hurt, depth was good, everything just, you know, I felt like there was more there, which was really good, really nice to see. Now, the proprietor of this facility had recently competed or taken his trip to the sun, if you will, and uh, didn't fare so well. Now, the reason I'm telling you this is he, he tore a quad and I went to do my comp bench. Couldn't get a hand off because I didn't want to ask a guy who had just blown his quad off competing if he would mind handing out for me. So I self-handed out a 182 and a half kilo bench and uh, hit a pretty decent little single there. I think I could have done more, but uh, obviously I'm, I'm one of those people who's pretty, pretty spoiled by handoffs. So it was a solo venture, if you will. Now I also, on my day one, hit some overhead press and it was 90 kilos for a set of six. So again, huge improvements there, big PR, pretty happy about that. I'm just preparing some sustenance here. I managed to figure out a couple ways to try to get some decent nutrition in, in this base, this habitation. Now day two was traditionally deadlift versus chains, but because there were no chains at this other facility, I was forced to use bands, a band setup. Now luckily they had a really good band setup and I was able to load, I think it worked out to about 370 at the top, so 815 pounds for a decent single. Did some triples there. Um, and a mid-range pin press that day as well. I worked up to 205 kilos. There was another guy there who gave me a handoff, which was great. And it like, it flew. And I felt like it was probably only about a two board from the chest. So uh, yeah, I'm damn happy with that. Day three as per usual is where things start to get really damn good. Now, really exciting. So worked up through my opener, started actually my first single at my opener, 375, miss grooved it, the wraps weren't quite right. And honestly, at this point, I would be way more concerned if an opener the week before the meet went well, as, as opposed to it going somehow off. I went from there, hit 380, and then 385, and both of those, however heavier, moved much better. Depth was really good on the 380. So I think I'm in a really good place. Bench worked up to a single at 255 kilos, so matched my all-time PR on that. And it moved, it, it flew, like it moved really, really well. So I think I'll be opening around 250 kilos. And uh, that was pretty much my day three, yeah. Lifter's log, number 4,678. It is uh, Saturday, February 27th, and we're here at the hygiene station getting groomed by the uh, haircut robot slash sex robot. <laughs> they programmed him a sense of humor for some reason. So deadlifts today went really well. Uh, warming up felt good. The suit felt a little bit loose. Uh, on this day, I think I need to eat another kilo or so back onto my body before I compete here. But uh, worked up to a top single, 375 kilos, a uh, bunch of triples at 335 afterwards, which was nice. The single moved well, grip held, maybe wasn't as snappy as I would have liked, but that's also 10 kilos above my opener right now. So it moved at about an eight, which is what I should be expecting. I am really happy that I survived so far. I mean, the true test is really gonna be when we set course for the sun and see how all that goes. I will be back. I will continue to log progress when I return to this desolate wasteland. But for now, this is me, Bryce Krawczyk, signing off.